What's up, guys? It's Brian from Hash Right Hub. It's about 8.45 p.m., February 1st, 2018. We're coming to you with a brand-new trading video on Cardano. I think it's been some time we've done this on Cardano. We're also going to be doing IOTA. Same is true with IOTA. I also don't think we've spoken about IOTA for some time, um, really for no good reason. Uh, we've just, I guess, been concentrating on the other coins as far as, um, as, far as videos are concerned. Uh, but first, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, upvote, re-steam uh, if you guys are on Steemit and or DTube. If not, the links are down below. Check that out. It's interesting at the very least. Also, our Facebook trading uh, team uh, link is down below in the description too. So let's get right into it here. So we have um, you know, a few different things going on with Cardano and, and IOTA and... You know, like I had mentioned uh, before, I think in another video, you know, we look at a lot of different patterns at the same time. And there's only a few that we show you guys, which are kind of like our top three, um, usually of the, or top two sometimes of, of, you know, patterns of whatever's going on with that particular coin. So <clears throat> let's just guess, I guess let's kind of get right into it right here. We're going to be um, also showing you kind of like two or three um possibilities top two three possibilities for each one of these coins too so this is a four hour chart for cardano and really what we're looking at is our our, our two possible two possible um uh uh you know trends or two possible formations as far as chart formations are concerned regarding uh elliott wave analysis uh, or elliott wave theory so we have uh, possibly an A, B, C correction, or we also have this W, X, Y correction. And I haven't mentioned this before. So in, in, in Elliott Wave Theory, there's uh, like a W, X, Y uh, corrections. There's also W, X, Y, X, Z corrections, which are obviously a little bit longer and more complex. And the complexity increases from there drastically. And this... Uh, these are p patterns that we've been watching for quite some time now on, on a bunch of different current coins. I haven't mentioned them because I find a lot of the people uh, on our channel in particular are a little are a little newer, and I don't want to kind of scare them with uh, you know newer chart patterns. With that said, I had made mention before in some other videos that we will be working on. We're going to probably start working on it in the next week or two. Um, a full-blown Elliott Wave Theory uh, tutorial. And that's going to go over everything regarding to Elliott Wave. Um, it's going to be one of these types of tutorials you're going to have to watch several times over because it's just going to be chock full of a lot of information. I have hesitated doing it because I'm kind of a perf I'm not kind of I am a perfectionist and when I like to do things I like to kind of just you know jump full in and I need to kind of clear some things out of my schedule in order to make that type of time in order to do something like this. So and I want to do the, do the, I want to do it justice. I want to do 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 the right thing uh, not only by my subscribers uh, by our subscribers which we're so thankful for but also at the same time I also want to do um, you know the theory justice. Um, so yeah, so, you know, let's, let's, um, kind of, you know, just keep that in the back of our minds as we move forward and a lot more of this is going to make sense over time. So <clears throat> regardless of which one of these directions it possibly can take, as far as these two that I mentioned, we're thinking that, um, Cardano can make a low somewhere around 30 cents level. And this is also taking consideration with what's going on with with uh, with Bitcoin. And we we take a look at Bitcoin real quick. Uh, hold up a sec. Okay, we take a look at Bitcoin re real quick. It seems to be trying to reach for this bottom bottom line, this bottom blue line right here. Let's call this um, I don't know 8150, 8100. Depends on where it where it hits it hit where it hits it. So it looks like it's trying to reach down for, for, for this blue line. If that's the case, then you know Cardano is probably going to come down to come down to these these lows right here, somewhere around here. Um, this may be a little too conservative, but I think somewhere around here is 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 a possibility. So that's what's going on with Cardano. Let's take a look at IOTA. 
Iota, Iota, Iota. Um, Okie dokie. So Iota also is exhibiting um, this WXYXZ uh, formation. I don't have it written up here because it's just going to messy things up even a bit more. And um, but uh, you know it's 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 pretty straightforward. Once I teach it to you guys, it's a little bit different way of thinking as far as Elliott wave theory is concerned. But it's uh, you'll 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 understand that. Um, I'm donating 500 to. <laughs> Okay, thank you. <laughs> um, so, um, yeah, so there are two two other types of of analyses that we are looking at. We're looking at an ABC correction. We're also looking uh, at this, you know, one, two, three, four, five wave, which is be coming down from from basically from from up here, and this this um it's kind of this it's kind of the same thing as far as this a b c where the c should have should have five waves um there's another way of going ahead and, and taking a look at this and like that's what i was saying before when the for the w x y x z where that's the reason one another reason why i'm also counting it in this fashion here so um five waves yeah five waves would would lead us to be somewhere around this level right here about 68 cents is what I'm thinking which happens to be a low right here all right let's draw that line real quick all right um, you know actually this line even if I were to extend it out you know you could see there was Sorry, I'm extending the wrong thing. Come on. You can see that the market kind of, even over here, all the way back here, you know, there was some support at this level. So I do think that the market could get down back to this level, call it about 71 cents, 71, 72 cents. And that would... Um, that would be a very healthy correction, uh, to say to say the least. Considering the fact that you know we had a cup and handle, we had another cup and handle, and now we're coming back down, down to these levels right here. This is this would be a very very uh, healthy um, corrective uh, correction. Now we also have. Um, just want to see something real quick. Yeah, no. Okay. Um, so we also have, I'm getting uh, confused with a different coin that I was looking at earlier, but so many coins that I'm, that I'm following at the same time. So um, what we also have with IOTA is not only kind of this, this WXYXZ, which I don't have plotted here, um, or this ABC uh, correction, what we also have is, is, is this wedge. And there were a few wedges back here. And, you know, I'm going to actually, yes, I'm going to delete some lines. I know, it's crazy. He's deleting lines. Um, okay. So, um, yeah, so th there is the possibility of, 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 of this being a top of a wedge, okay, and this blue line being the bottom of the wedge and that would that would make this you know an a b c d and this would be an e and it would come up from here okay there's another way to go ahead and look at it and i don't like it as much but um this could be the a b c d you know, and this could have been the E, and then don't, don't, you know, these things can go longer than A, B, C, D, E. They can go A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I. I mean, they can, they can go on for some time. Um, it, it happens a lot in the traditional markets. Um, so this would be E, and then this is a different formation right here. So I don't think that's necessarily the case. I think it's the first one that I mentioned for the sake of the fact that it just looks better um, and it fits the WXYXZ uh, formation much better.
And again, I'll get to that at another time. Most likely through the to- most likely through the uh, tutorial. So, if this were to make the third wave of this five wave, uh, uh, w- you know, wave called the C wave right here, uh, the third wave we're hoping is going to go ahead and end somewhere on this support right here, on this resistance line right here. It could be right here, you know, it could be right here, it could be somewhere anywhere along here. If that's the case, and possibly it may make you know, uh, 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 you know, a, a correction, and maybe it'll hit this, um, you know, it'll hit this green line right here, and then maybe it'll come down and it'll hit this, it'll, you know, hit this level right here that we were talking about before about the seventy cents. However, it may not. It may just go ahead and just hit the blue line, and then we know we have the, um, we have this, uh, this, this downward facing wedge, which is bullish. So. We're not really going to know until kind of later on. We may not, we may, the market may actually go ahead and make like a bullish wick right here, which it tends to do uh, more times than not. And some people may think of this as like a, as the, as the actual fifth, but it, but it usually is not the fifth. So um, another thing I want to take a look at is let's take a look at on the QQE indicator, uh, which is right here. And this is this is bearish. Obviously, it has crossed over. I don't think we went over the QQE indicator on Cardano, but yeah, I mean Cardano um, crossed over here. You know, not too bad. Actually, really good. So um, that's really about it for right now, as far as as far as Cardano and IOTA. If you guys have any questions or concerns, you know, just let us know. And um, yeah, happy trading. Speak to you soon.